the remote and bleak mountains of Kyrgyzstan. The Soviet Union once delivered electricity and light here to isolated communities like Atbachi. But the power supply isn't reliable. It's often affected by snowstorms, avalanches and floods. That's why the staff at this hospital eagerly awaited these solar panels. They'll end its dependency on the power grid. It's a pilot project by the World Health Organization. Arto Buyuklianov is responsible for the logistics. This is a mountainous region. The people generally live at an altitude of over 2,500 meters, and there are extreme temperature fluctuations. And that's why these regions feel the negative impacts of climate change the most. The last winter was unusually long, and spring has been much too wet so far, say farmers at the Atbachi market. They're worried about their harvests. Gildes Bek-Kaparov has begun sowing late. The fields and meadows are still too wet. He's worried he won't have enough fodder for his horses. The weather's changing. Last year, for example, we had the harvest, we hadn't yet taken in the hay. Suddenly, one day in fall, we had our first snow. It covered everything. We had no fodder for the cattle during the winter. Yes, we certainly noticed the climate changing. In the face of such challenges, renewable energy and energy efficiency are only slowly gaining ground in Kyrgyzstan. These batteries store solar power. Arto Boyuklyanov has had to grapple with logistical as well as technical problems. Next time, we'll be able to avoid a lot of the difficulties that we experienced with this project. When the next solar panels are installed, it'll all go smoothly. The hospital in Atbachi is a step in the right direction. Senior consultant Muratbek Alyaskarov's team and his patients will certainly stand to benefit. The doctors will soon have a reliable supply of electricity even when the power from the grid is disrupted through extreme weather or avalanches. We'll get electricity free of charge, so we'll save a lot, and that will naturally help to save money for the entire country. And this hospital is just the beginning. Once these panels are installed, further hospitals in Kyrgyzstan are due to convert to clean solar energy as well.